What's up guys, welcome to another uh, video here on the channel. So today, we're starting FIFA 22. Um, I just finished the download for the early access EA Play version. Um, anybody can get that, you do just have to pay for EA Play. Um, you can see it's noted here as a trial, but we can play the full game for 10 hours. I'm super excited to be bringing this content to you guys. There will be more to come. This video is how to start FIFA 22 Ultimate Team. So, as you can see, we have a 10 hour trial here. I'm going to be spending a lot of that trial trying to make videos for you guys, trying to get some games in, uh, mess around online, start our club, uh, start our ultimate team. If you guys are interested um, in career mode content, I'm happy to provide that. Just let me know in the comments. Um, I can do a beginner's guide to career mode, how to create a club, things like that. Uh, but for right now, we are focusing on how to start ultimate team. So we're going to walk through the uh, the setup here. I am experienced. Um I'm actually going to skip this cutscene. You guys can totally watch it. Uh, I guess you have to create your pro here. Um, we'll just pick this guy. Send. I am. Let's do this. We really don't need all of this nonsense. Quit. Yes. Okay. We can come back to that later. That must be for Volta. Um, if you guys are interested in um, in any Volta content, I'm happy to look at my character there. Sorry for that confusion. I hadn't started the game yet. This is literally the first time. So now you guys know. Of course, we um, will accept the user agreement as soon as it lets us. These are my settings. Play on Legendary, Classic. Favorite team is Everton, as painful as that is. Uh, and yeah, we'll share our information. No problem. We don't need any of that. And we are syncing up to the the game now all right so we're going to enter ultimate team to see our original rewards in this video we're going to be opening up our packs um we're going to be talking about um you know how to start ultimate team right so how to how to get the best possible start to ultimate team now there will be a series i uh, shouldn't be <laughs> rocking around like that sorry guys um there should be um a bunch of videos coming out with specifics about single player ultimate team beginner's guide to uh, online player ultimate team beginner's guide to squad building um, there will be beginner's guides to a great number of things coming out over the next few days now this is actually more important than you realize I would advocate going with England Germany um, Brazil and maybe France or Argentina like I wouldn't go with Italy Netherlands Portugal Spain there's just not as many players now for the starter SBCs doing those countries I just mentioned anything across the top line Argentina or Germany you get a lot of different um, uh, players and a lot more players that are readily available to uh, kind of match up with that nation so I'm actually gonna go with I'm gonna go with England I'm gonna go with England it's probably a very popular choice but I'm gonna go with England it's popular popular for a reason right so let's see who we get an English striker from Roma, Tammy Abraham. Not a bad starter striker. Good finishing, good shooting, um, and some solid physical as well. Not great pace, but you know we'll make do with him. Um, nobody else too interesting. Oh, Will Hughes used to be a uh, career mode legend. I thought we normally got three golds, but apparently there's only two. So that's totally fine. So um, there's a lot of starter objectives that you can do by putting players like into their correct position. So for example, if I put that left mid out there, he's now in his correct position. Forgive my dog. Oh, there's the third gold player. I wasn't even looking. We get, um, is this Rob White? Ben White. Ben White. Uh, 69 pace, 77 defending, 76 physical. That is not bad for a gold common card. Um, put him out there and we'll put Will Hughes in the middle. Just making a couple changes. So now what I can actually do is advance. Let's add a high-rated loan player to your squad. Now, loan players didn't used to matter at all, but they introduced friendly modes last year. And friendly modes don't take contracts off of your players. So, that means you can sign a loan player, and you could conceivably keep him forever. As long as you don't use these games in um, in normal game modes, and you only play them in friendly. So, Jaden Sancho would be, a, would be a good pick there, except he's 81 pace, which is insane. Let's see... Who's that striker? Erling Holland. Holland might be my go-to here. I mean, an 88-rated striker with 89 pace and 91 shooting. That seems insane. Let's see if there's anybody good at, at uh, left midfield. Coleman and Rashford, both good players, but Holland still got it for me. We probably don't want to take a defender. I was just taking a look. Definitely don't want to take a goalkeeper. Let's look at, uh, at midfield. 
Pogba is a consideration, but I think Erling Holland is just too good not to take. I know he doesn't have chemistry with any of my my players right here, but it will be good to have him for um for those friendly matches, like I said. So don't pick a player who fits your original team. It doesn't matter. Um, you'll be able to get a starter shot pretty, pretty quickly, and I will talk about that. Um, oh, this Belgium kit is nice. I like that. We'll take that. And then something that contrasts pretty well. Oh, this Spurs kit. I bet you that sells for a lot. You might want to take kits that do sell for a lot. I'm not going to play the game so hardcore that you do that. Um, although, I will probably take a badge. Man City is probably going to sell for a little bit more than PSG. And so this is my first squad. Let's get onto that pitch. That that Spurs jersey looks so nice. My friend, uh, my friend Mike is a Spurs supporter, which may even be more painful than supporting Everton. Um, but the, at least they have nice jerseys. You can watch them losing. Um, these jerseys right here are really nice. I'll probably throw those on the Foot Twenty One Icons. Uh, that away jersey, that black jersey looks so good. Now you may or may not have the same uh, or similar rewards uh, to me. I have two gold packs, uh, a Stadium Starter Pack. A gold player, four gold players packs featuring one 80 plus player. I also have a big coin boost for 15 matches. Um, so these are just rewards that are coming with us. Uh, forgive the jangling. My, uh, my my dog's running around behind me. Um, so, yeah, so you get actually quite a bit when you start off. Now, right here, we're right into our packs. They're going to want us to open these packs, and we will do that. So I'm not going to sell anything right now. Oh, we have items to deal with already. Oh, yeah, nice. Okay, so... So we have these jerseys. Um, you can't put them on from this screen anymore. I wish you could, but I'm just going to throw them all to the club. And, of course, we have a player pick, a foot ambassador loan. Okay, now, David Alaba doesn't quite have the pace to be an elite center back, in my opinion. So, again, this is a loan, so we technically only have him for three games. Um, but we can keep him, play him in friendlies uh, kind of indefinitely. Now, Phil Foden would fit really nicely into our England squad. But again, that's not necessarily what we're looking for. Hyunmin Son, on the other hand, 88 pace, 87 shooting, and 86 dribbling get in the club. All right. So, walking through these, these picks here. So, we should be able to open our packs now. We do have a stadium starter pack. I thought we got a, a lone icon at some point. Maybe that won't come out until... Um, until next week, but all right. So I don't know anything about the pack animations um, or how to tell if you have a good good card yet. Um, I'll be actually watching some YouTube videos on that later. But Ross Barkley, not a bad start. Again, an England player, so he'll slot right into our squad with our other golds right now. Um, nobody else crazy. Nothing worth too much. Oh, we have a goal song at the end there. Nothing worth too much in that pack, but you know it's always good to get these these cards. We'll see what sells for what. And we'll take it from there, of course. All right, let's see who else is in our gold pack. Uh, I don't even think this is a rare player, but this is Badiashil. Um, not great pace. French, French League. We'll link with some people, but probably not worth playing. Oh, my God. Look at how many players we got in that pack. Um, this guy, Valencia, just has super sub written off, off the bench, written all over him. 88 pace, 74 shooting, 73 dribbling. Uh, definitely looks like... Like, he could be usable. Uh, an Italian manager probably has value pretty early on in the game. And uh, and let's see. Finisher, not a bad one as well. So, again, these cards may have some good value. Let's check out this Stadium Starter Pack. Wow, that was crazy. What was that? So, we have the club nickname, the Old Lady. Uh, I think that's Juventus's nickname, is it not? Old Lady? I don't know. Um... So we can quick sell a bunch of this stuff. Uh, these what? Why are these worth so much? That can't be the base value all the time now, right? No, it's not. Look at how much this discards for. So I think we're gonna discard these cards. We're gonna quick sell them. Look how much they quick sell for. This might be a one-time thing. I don't know, guys. I really don't know what's going on with that. So we're just gonna keep like. The Man City Stadium theme, because that might sell for a lot. But we're going to get rid of... Well, you know what? We'll keep that, because we might have to put that on. So we're going to kind of keep, like, one of each there. Whoops. That doesn't need to go to the transfer list. We already have a badge and whatever, so we'll keep that. But look, we have 2,100 coins right off the bat. Yes, we don't need to sell that again. Please don't play with that hot dog, Atlas. Sorry about that. Um, all right. And so now, in each of these packs, we are guaranteed to have one rare player... 
and that rare player is guaranteed to be 80 plus rated okay so let's take a look that was a cool little flash screen I like I don't know if that has anything to do with anything but okay center mid from Napoli 82 rated Fabian okay not a bad start not upset with that at all and we're just getting a bunch more fodder to put into our club um these quick sell values are weird. I don't know what's going on with that. Um, all right, so we'll take another one. I'm hoping for something awesome, obviously, right? Like, isn't everybody? So that was purple. The one before that was blue. This is red flames. So that's an 84. So red flames must must be like 83 plus. So, and then we had that purple flash right before we opened it. So an 84 rated player is really, really good. That's a great start. Um, High rated meta players are going to hold a lot of value. A lot of these guys um, can probably get quick sold. Uh, I'm going to look what he's listed at on the market. So let's compare price. Yeah, see, nobody's buying this guy for 600 coins. Nobody's ever going to buy him for that. So he's actually just worth discarding. So I get the coins now. So I can actually start making some coins off of him later. All right, so let's see. That was orange. I wonder if that makes a difference. And with red flames. 83. Okay, so I think Red Flames is definitely the key to you have a an 83 uh, plus player. Okay, so that's interesting. So we're learning it. We're learning it. Angelino, uh, Bundesliga right back. Doesn't have some uh, you know fantastic pace, which you're really looking for out of your fullbacks, but there are definitely worse players to get. And finally, our last and final pack. Let's see. And that was a blue again. So I bet you this one's like not good. Yeah, didn't even have flares. Oh, Richarlison! I take it all back! Richarlison from Everton. Um, so, again, he wasn't 83+, plus, so he didn't get those like big flares on the side. But you know what? I bet you Richarlison's got some uh, some good value. And and he might actually be really, really fun to use. Brazilian striker from Everton. Um, I really like him, I think. Uh, I wonder what he's going for. Let's look. Five-star skills, four-star weak foot. Compare price. Uh, he's going for 7,700 uh, 7, coins already. You love to see it. So we're not going to list him yet, although that's a great poll. We probably should list him, um, but I'm not going to list him right this second. Just one more thing to go over while we're talking about packs. Um, of course, you can buy FIFA points, um, but there are classic packs, which are the bronze, um, silver, and gold packs. Oh, that's interesting. They took out the, the 400 coin bronze packs because people used to make money on that pack. They took it out. That's super interesting. And then, of course, right now they have gold packs. Now, they have preview packs. So watch this. I'm going to open this pack. I didn't buy it with anything. I'm just opening it. And I had that orange flash. No, um, no crazy uh, flares, of course. And we don't get a super high-rated player. But if this had somebody great in it, like, um, I don't know, let's say this had um, Paul Pogba in it. I would buy this pack for 7,500 coins because I'd make more, excuse me, selling that Pogba afterwards. So I know what's in the pack in advance. I know whether I want to spend my coins on that. And that, of course, gets updated every 24 hours. All right. So. I don't need to play now, but I just want to go to the main menu. Awesome. Thank you. All right. So that's probably enough for this video. This is just how to, like, open up your club start getting started opening up those packs trying to maximize our profit again we're going to go back to our um our uh players here and we're going to uh first make our squad we're going to put in the players that we want to play with then we're going to look at starting to make a starter squad to kind of play some squad battles but that'll all be in a future video this is just how to open up some uh open up ultimate team and get started um, be on the lookout for my beginner's guide videos, beginner's guide to single player, beginner's guide to online, beginner's guide to um, squad building, and then anything else that you guys have questions on. Please leave them in the comments below. Don't forget to like the video if this helped you out at all, and I will talk to you guys in the next one. Thanks. Bye. Say goodbye to your own life. Turn the page, follow my bed. I don't care.